We begin tonight with your health. With the warmer temperatures here, a lot of you will be finding relief in local bodies of water, like perhaps the Congaree River. But have you ever wondered what's in the water? Well, now a new tool from DHEC might help you and your family have a better idea. News 19's Peyton Lewis joins us in studio tonight with more details. Peyton. JR living in Columbia for a little more than a year now. I've noticed that sometimes rivers like Saluda or parts of the Congaree will close for high bacteria levels. Well, now health agencies around the Midlands are teaming up to make this data easier to access. As the weather gets warmer, the crowds will start to roll on the rivers and lakes around the Midlands. Sun's out, get some tanning in. Yeah, it was pretty nice. I'm just really happy that we have the river here. But how often are people checking up on the water to make sure it's safe before they take a dip? Now, I feel like usually, I mean, if you're in college, you, you kind of know you just kind of go out and have a good time. You're not really worried about anything other than other than like just floating. It's not the same water going around when the flow it's new water. I usually don't worry about those things. DHEC has signs posted around the Congaree and Saluda River to let people know that the water is tested weekly from May until October. I reached out about this testing and DHEC sent this statement saying, quote, it's always recommended that individuals evaluate a water body before entering it. If a water body looks discolored, has a foul odor, noticeable algae or dead fish or other animals. It's advisable to not enter the water or allow pets or animals near that water. And if you're thinking about visiting a body of water near you anytime soon, you can visit the House by SC River website, housebysc.river.org to check bacteria levels. If you see green like you see here, then you're good to go. But if you see any other notifications like this orange or yellow warning, then it might not be the best day to visit. I would definitely take it into consideration, especially since, you know, I do want to actually enjoy being in the water. And DHEC says you can also download their harmful algae bloom app if you want more information. Reporting in studio, Peyton Lewis, News 19 WLTX.